How's it going YouTube? It's RJ here and in today's video I'm going to be showcasing a Funko haul. Now Funko is going to kind of die down a little bit on this channel and it's going to be a little bit more Pokemon oriented with some live streams but I just wanted to let you guys know I'm not giving up on Pokemon. Absolutely not. But I think that this right here is kind of a interesting haul but after Comic Con things with Funko will die down a bit because Saving money is important, and this Comic Con is going to kill my wallet. But onwards to the video. Uh, first thing I want to showcase is actually the Unmasked Gwenpool. I picked this up from Walgreens. It's been out for a while, but decided to get it now because, you know, who knows if it's not going to be there next week. And I think this is the best looking Gwenpool out of all of them. I think I'm only missing just the common one, which. I, is there a common one? I think there is. But I just wanted to round out my collection a little bit. But I picked this up. But yeah, this is pretty cool. I got the Comic Con exclusive one. And the other exclusive Toys R Us one. But I decided to pick up the Walgreens one. Then I also picked this up from FYE. Because I had to pick a third pop to get the third pop for 75% off. Pick this one up because I actually don't have this common one. I actually have the Chase version. But this is actually pretty cool. Very happy to have him in my collection finally. I have to work on getting this Guardians line finished. I gotta get both of the Guardians lines finished. And I would love to, but you know, it's expensive. But you know, that's what happens whenever you make videos. And you want to buy complete sets. But yeah, Star-Lord. Really, really cool. Then I got this from Hot Topic, and I added this on to go get my last thing of Hot Cash before um, before I couldn't get Hot Cash anymore. But yeah, I actually picked this one up. It goes along well with my two other ones that I have back there. Uh, you can see the Wonder Woman just slightly behind the Supergirl. And then my Gardevoir card is covering up the Poison Ivy just a little bit. But you know, this is definitely going to be back in the, the background for you guys to look at. Next, um, got these from Hot Topic because they were $7 a piece, so I got the Robin with Baby, and then I got Medusa from the Inhumans. Now, don't really care too much for Teen Titans Go, but I've seen the episode actually where this was actually showcased, and I said, you know what, might as well get it, it's Teen Titans, it's DC, I'll collect it anyway. And then the Medusa, I actually really like the character design, I don't think the Inhumans TV show did very well and that's probably why this character doesn't sell very much but for seven dollars I didn't think you could beat that very there's not much you can beat for seven dollars so pick that up and that helped me get my hot cash just with these two and the last few items I want to showcase and this is the big reason why I wanted to get the hot cash because I was buying this Batgirl right here so you can already see I have the original Batgirl from the DC Heroes right here that I got from a friend of mine. But I got this Diamond exclusive, the Diamond Collection Hot Topic exclusive one, and it looks really good for it. I think that the Harley Quinn looks better in my opinion, but I wanted to pick this one up anyway because I actually don't have that Batgirl, I don't think. I think I just have the uh, blue and black version of that. But yeah, this one's actually really cool to have in my collection. So, there we go. Batgirl from the Diamond Collection. Then I got this from GameStop. Today is the day that these have been released. This is Janet Van Dyne. I actually would have been able to get this a little bit earlier. However, it was street dated. So they held it for me. Now, they put a rubber band around it and it kind of damaged it a little bit. But I don't really care at this point. I just really wanted it. And then Funko announces, hey, we have an unmasked version of this going to Target. And I'm like, you suck, Funko. But no, uh, it's going to be a pain to get that. And now every single last character on here has a variant. Two chases for Ant-Man and Wasp. Ghost has an invisible variant. Hank Pym has an unmasked variant. Jack Van Dyne has an unmasked variant. And I'm just thinking, oh my gosh, there's ten pops in this one wave for this... Small movie in scale, honestly. So, you know, it's alright. I have to get both the unmasked versions. And I have to get both Chase variants, for sure. Because I ordered online with Hot Cash the Wasp exclusive. and I mean, the Wasp 
so maybe I might get the chase, but normally don't count on it. So I have to get both chase variants, and then I actually have to get the common ghost because I actually ordered the Walmart exclusive one just two days ago. But yeah, Janet Van Dyne from the movie Ant-Man and the Wasp. Now, I don't know what to showcase next. Uh, I'll showcase this next. Let's see, does it fit? Yes, it does. I have the Jason Voorhees Friday the 13th cereal, which today's actually Friday the 13th, so that's why I picked this one over the Freddy Krueger one. Now, I don't know if I should eat this and review it, or I should just keep it in a box. You guys let me know, because I honestly don't know what to do with it at this point. But yeah, this is actually really, really cool. I should just... I don't know if you guys want me to do an unopening of this in general, but yeah, that's actually pretty cool to get this, so I'm keeping that. Now, there's three items. One's going to be difficult to showcase, but I'm going to showcase that right now because the other two are items that aren't even released yet, announced yet. I got this bad boy. Holy God, it's huge. I'm serious, like, I did, like, I have the 10-inch Porg. This seems bigger than the Porg for some reason. I don't know why, but this is amazing. Now, this is the Target-exclusive Jurassic World one from The Fallen Kingdom. I actually like that movie, and I went and rewatched it yesterday. I really like it. There's a few things I had issues with, but, you know, I think it was better than the first Jurassic World, which I think is better than... Honestly, I think it's better than the third one, and I think it's tied for the second one. So I think this one's a little bit better than the second one, which is pretty good. So out of one, out, I think the only one that's perfect in most cases is Jurassic Park, the first one. But yeah, this is the Tyrannosaurus Rex from Target. 10 inch. Holy God, is it big. I don't know. Should I take it out of the box to show you guys? Ah! I don't know, not in this video, not in this video, because honestly, in this little display area I have, it can't, like, it, that's how it fits in. It's so huge, it's like, impossible, like, holy god. You can stack up two pops next to it, and it's still not the same size as this box. Now, the last items I want to showcase are pretty darn cool. I was able to get the Predator and the Super Predator. Now this comes from the movie The Predator and I'm very happy to have this in my collection especially this early. Now from what I know there is a chase version of both the Predator and the Predator dog because what I was told from the people at FYE they were like they didn't get the Predator dog but when they scanned for it there's actually a chase variant for the Predator dog and there's a chase variant for the Predator this one right here where he's actually unmasked but yeah this is super cool I already unboxed these if you want to go check them out check my Instagram page uh, I think it's RJ Kenzel but holy god I'm so excited to have these early but yeah you tell me what you guys think of these um I was gonna pick them up probably anyway but if you guys like this video Please hit that thumbs up button and I have one more video for you guys coming up probably next week for a figurine that I got. But yeah, uh, hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys next time with more Funko content. So until then, YouTube, goodbye.